Yeah, I thought I'd start recording again because this part of the walk's quite pretty. So I thought I'd let people see what it's like along this, this stretch of Hamsterley Forest with the ferns on either side. As you can see, it's quite a dilly div there ahead, blazing a nice trail on the beaten track, as it were. As nimble as a proverbial mountain goat. With his bottle, is it ginger bee you've got there, Dave? Yeah, Shandy. Shandy, keep you going. <laughs> and we're just passing through the carnivorous bracken, hoping not to get bitten. Because my friend Vagabond Bob tells me it can be quite unpredictable at this time of year. And I do believe it's related to the triffids. But he could be pulling my leg, anything's possible with Bob. Nothing's bit you yet, Dave, right? Oh. None of the bracken's bit you yet, you're okay, you say. I think we've had our injections. So if anything does bite us, we should be safe. We've had our boosters or whatever. It's like being in the jungle, isn't it, Dave? Yeah. <laughs> all this, look at all these ferns, it's incredible. It's like we're in Jurassic Park. I haven't been attacked by any boojums or snarks yet. A velociraptor could be lurking in the ferns though, anything's possible. This is getting a bit wild, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> I think we should have brought machetes <laughs> to cut our way through the bracken. I wasn't expecting this, but it's, it's, it's a welcome surprise though. Feels nice and wild. Back in the open, no. Yeah, heading back into the open, thankfully. <laughs> nice little bridge. Across the dry, the dry stream bed which we speculated on. Back on, back into the open meadow. Still very idyllic landscape here. Panning around there. So we're slightly, heading slightly upward now, aren't we, Dave? Yeah. A, bit of, a bit of an ascent. Yeah, it looks that way. More of the carnivorous bracken up ahead, by the look of things. I don't think you can get away from it, it's pretty ubiquitous around here. Let me know if you come across any boojums or snarks, Dave. Yeah. You, can you, can, you can tell by their distinctive call. But it's not the mating season, so they're probably quiet at this time of year. Plus, they should be hibernating as well. And when we get to this uh, new crossing point, I believe there's a sty coming up. I think that's a convenient time to end it, this part of the video. It looks like we're approaching the paid car park, right, Dave? Yeah, yeah. Good, yeah. The one, the one we so deftly avoided. <laughs> we parked up further down, didn't we? We got it. We got. We, we parked up for free. Yeah. I recall. So I shall end it here, and I'll say thanks to any potential viewers. Thank you again for watching. <laughs>